Good morning, Talon Squad! Mr. Talon here, bringing you another Daily to Talon. Today, we have some more VGC 20 in the Battle Spot ranked live, featuring more of the Lycanroc team. The team is right up there. As you see, we made a slight change. We dropped Nihilego for a Lycanroc, just because the feel of the same purpose, same typing. Granted, I get stab poison from Nihilego. I wanted the fast amount to deal better with Garchomp, so we have nine tails on the team now. But without Aurora Veil, we have Freeze Dry, because I don't like Aurora Veil. It's either hit or it's very hit or miss. And things like still die even Aurora Veil being up, so... We have Encore into the Aurora Veil, and that is the only change we've made. And then Coco has Life Orb instead of Sash now, because Ninetales has a Sash. So that is that. See my opponent with a Nihilego, Finny, Marowak, Kartsana, Arcanine, and a Vikavolt, my friend. So for me, we're going to have a lead of... Gyarados sounds incredible. Gyarados Arcanine sounds incredible, to be honest. Gyarados can kill Nihilego, Arcanine can kill Kartsana... Uh, Gyarados can kill Marowak and Arcanine as well. Arcanine kills Vikavolt. And then there's Finny. Hmm. He's gonna be Nihilego Trick Room, I believe, though. Alright, let's go uh, Gyarados, Arcanine, Bulu. And then, last but certainly not least, we'll go with the lovely Lycanroc. And that's going to be the game one square right there, my friends. So, if you're excited for some more videos in the channel, show some love to the like button down below. I greatly appreciate that. And let's get this battle on the way. Try to get another 3-0. That'd be awesome. That'd be incredible. I'm excited. Here we go, my friends. New chair hype. I'm comfortable. And I'm loving my, uh, my back support right now. So, here we go, my friends. Game number one underway. Let's see what opponent leaves with. Kartsana Finney. Beautiful. Beautiful. We're gonna go D-Dance uh, Gyarados, and then with Arcanine, I'll probably just go for Snarl. Go with that Finny switch old set, because you might protect the Kartana. I feel like you do protect Kartana here. Or your Sacred Sword Muddy Water. Would you do that? I don't know. Kartana's at neck to its sack. So I'm pretty sure he's gonna switch out here. I'm gonna go for D-Dance with Gyarados all day. Yeah, we're gonna D-Dance with Gyarados all day. Dragon Dance Gyarados. And then Arcanine either snarls or it turns into Bulu. But if I turn into Bulu... If I turn into Bulu, Kartana gets stabbed, increased, but... He's at neck to its sack, so how bad could that really be? And I can get all water attacks, get the turn in my favor, get statuses back online. Not like it really matters, but you know what? I'm just gonna go for a snarl and call Kartana to switch out. Into like Nihilego or something. Let's do that. I don't, see, I don't see Cortana staying in with a neck to spell attack. Cortana protects exactly. So D Dance goes off. We get a free D Dance. We're going to get a Snarl on the Finny as he goes for a Combine, Muddy Water, Moon Blast. I don't know. There's a D Dance right there. We have to be that Cortana now. Beautiful. Snarl goes off. We're faster than the Finny. Definitely have a Trick of Nihilego then. Definitely have a Trick of Nihilego without a doubt. Neg one, Finny is Neg one. Spitzak is dropping right there. Muddy Water goes off. No dodges, but it's a neg one, and it's already reduced because it's been in two Pokemon. Hang in there, my friends. Not much damage anywhere. Beautiful. All right. No drops either. Phenomenal, dude. Uh. Now, I think I'm going to go for the Z-Move in the Kartana slot. Actually, I'll just go for Finny. Super Sonic Sky Strike the Finny and Flamethrower the Kartana slot. Papercha's gonna switch up, but if the case it doesn't, I'm just gonna have to go flamethrower on him. Hit the Finny with this guy, with the Falani name Z. And then flamethrower Kartana. Because one of them, that, the, one, the one's at neg one, Finny's at neg one, Kartana's at neg two. There's gonna be some kind of switches going on here. Or protect. Kartana is exposed. Uh, We have good momentum in our favor, we have very good momentum right now in our favor. So I'm really not concerned. With like switching up my status right here, but we're gonna see a Nihilego come in. Oh, a Marowak come in. That's free waterfall fodder, so that's fine. And we're gonna hit Finny with the Sky and EMZ. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Now, this should kill us. He's really bulky. But I'm gonna say he's offensive because he has muddy water. No calm on. Now, I say he's max HP, max with attack, specs, or something going on like that. Because there's no lefties from Snarl. I don't think I, I, don't think I saw. I'm, I might be dumb minding seeing lefties, but. Let's see, is he gone? He should be gone. Beautiful, Finny is gone, just like that. We're gonna see Nihilego come in. 
Then we're going to see a Protect uh, Trick Room. So we got a Waterfall of Nihilego and uh, Snarl. So we're going to see Trick Room Nihilego coming in. Or maybe Cartana. Not Cartana. Definitely not Cartana. No way Cartana is coming in, dude. There's no way. It's going to be the Nihilego. He's going to go Protect. I'm going to Waterfall Nihilego and then Snarl as well. Just to make sure I hit both mods in case Merrick does not Protect. Great to the damage of Merrick doesn't even matter because I need Waterfall on him. So I might just double guarantee a kill on that Nihilego. Go Flamethrower Waterfall on it. And if he reads that on Boomerangs or Shadow Bones, that's going to suck. But I got to play safe here. Oh, Cartana comes in. What the is this thing going to do to me? Uh, I'm obviously going to go for Waterfall on Marowak. And Flamethrower the Cartana. Leaf Blade is neutral to me. Yeah, I'm fine with that. I outspeed him anyway, so. He's going to protect Marowak most likely. Okay, we're, killing Mar we're, go we're gonna kill Marowak, that's fine. Goodbye, Marowak! Plus one waterfall takes you down, just like that. Cartana goes Leaf Blade on Gyarados, swaps for a crit. And then you die or go to the Sash. Well, you got his crit, so there it is. That's unfortunate. We do kill Marowak. Thank God he didn't protect that. I've been pretty damn salt. Flamethrower for the K. Oh, or are you, like, not Sash? Maybe you're fighting MZ or aggressing MZ. Just die. Please don't be Sashed. Eh, uh, you are. Crit too. I'm mean, a crit matter because you're sash. But that's all right. We do have second punch on our lovely Lycan Rock over here. So we're probably gonna do that. Bring in our Lycan Rock as you bring in your Nihilego. I do that. Vagavolt wants to play ball. All right, Vagavolt. We have Stonish for you all day. Sucker punch that Kartsana. and then flamethrower the. Actually, we're gonna snarl Vagavolt. We're gonna snarl it. Let's do that. Second punch goes off. Goodbye, Kartsana! Our like a rock doing his job. Goodbye to you. Snarl goes off. Big damage there. Just kidding. Spatak jumps what we want. T Bolt shall now not take on the like a rock. Ooh, you go for the Arcanine. Alright, Stone Edge for game. We're moving the game too, my friends. That will be that. Stone Edge kills Vikavolt. And we just go for Flamethrower because that's what we do. And that is the game, my friends. That is the game. Getting mad here. Go on a game too, baby. We take that freaking solid 3-0 victory. Like a rock team proven to be pretty damn fun and solid, man. Alright, let's see if Ninetales is going to get some action right now. Ninetales, the game changer. Not the game changer, but the chomp, uh, the chomp killer extraordinaire. Great, it's sunny day on um, Driplim or like... Pelper Golduck's obviously always a problem for him because he's already a fast uh, weather user, but I like him. Sash, Encore, Blizzard, solid stuff there. Alright, continue battling, and let's see what opponent number two is going to have for us. Let's put on some... Let's put on some, uh, let's put on some lose, losing two. Losing me in two sounds great. Guys, I don't know why I just realized that, but you can use left or right on the D-pad to change the music. Never do that. Oh, excuse me, well, until like yesterday. Or the day before. Speaking of Pelper Golduck, there it is with the Lele, Metagross, Coco, Raichu. This man has freaking speed on deck for days. And that is honestly not good for us. Alright, if it's Pelper Golduck, we're gonna need like. I might just go Coco Ninetales. No, I'm not gonna do that. Actually, I am going to do that. Uh, or should I switch to the Nine Tails to go to the... It's not so really tough. It's honestly really tough. Alright, it's going to be Coco... Coco Gyarados... I need Arcanine for Metagross too, which is the worst part. Metagross is really good against this team. Uh, Coco, Gyarados, Arcanine, Ninetales. That's going to be the Game 2 squad right there, my friends. It's going to be a tough matchup. If we lose this one, it's no surprise. But we're going to do our best in this game, and we're going to get it underway right now, my friends, against our man, Antonio. All right, Antonio. You got a solid team, a very good team against my team. So we got to play it properly here. Maybe we should have brought Lycrock to second punch the Raichus and stuff. I might have misplayed that. I should have brought the Lycrock, honestly. 
Snack him off to get a uh, Pelper Golduck comes in. Yeah, we knew that. Uh, we're gonna go T Bolt on Golduck. I think we're gonna D Dance with Gyarados. And then protect Coco. But you might just you might just brawn ice beam my Gyarados. If you do, it's fine though. Drizzle is activated, so that gold duck is nice and fast now. Um We're just gonna turn Coco right to Bulu. I didn't bring Bulu. Uh we're gonna turn Coco right to Ninetales. And then we're going to de dance with the Gyarados. I think it's my play right there. I don't know exactly. I'm going to hope you go for like Wartier MZ on the uh, Ninetail slot. And Palper goes to like, I don't know what. The hell is up now. So I'm going to break Palper's head, which is a real important thing right now, to be honest. Hydro Pumper! Dead to the sash we go. Not even. Damn, dude, that was weak. What the fuck? Oh, because the rain's gone. Deep. Alright, there's a D-Dance right there! Beautiful job, Gyarados! And Pelper with the Tailwinds! Yes. Fluff another, dude. Now, do I double dance? Do I double dance, my friend? Do I double dance? I think I protect double dance. Because I can't Encore anything because they're all double speed now. If I double dance, I still might be outsped by Golduck. So my play right now is going to be my Z move on Golduck. So I have the HP to live it right now. We're attacking Golduck. He's faster than me, which sucks. So we're gonna protect Nine Tails. Pelper is out of here. We're gonna see it protect. Oh, if we see, if we see protect, I'm gonna scream, dude. I'm gonna scream, freaking. No, he didn't protect. His Nine Tails slower. Beautiful. Here comes the Ice Beam on Gyarados. Ooh, it locked me to D-Dance, huh? Not a bad play. Not a bad play at all. But it doesn't matter? Because I went for a Z-Move? That is insane. That is... Goodbye, Gary. Uh, goodbye, Golduck. That is honestly insane. Look at that body go, dude. Look at that body go. Goodbye, Golduck. That is honestly insane how you can't Encore. Wow. Z-Moves are busted. Z-Moves are busted. Right to if he has one, is broken. Guarantee he does it, but it's broken now. If I had Bulu, I'd slow you down real quick, but that, that Tailwind being up. So my left at the D-Dance now? What happens? Wow, that is insane. My opponent's like, what the fluff just happened? Is he bringing Palper here? Yep, there it is. And then we're gonna see... What do I do now, man? What do I do? The rain is back up. Terrain is still for like another 60 turns. Uh, two to the tailwind through the terrain. This Raichu is Electro Ball speed on its quad speed Raichu right now. All right, I think we're gonna go double protect on the Raichu here. On the no, we're gonna like Nine Tails drop. There's nothing we could do with Nine Tails to be honest. Absolutely nothing. Try to freeze dry Pelipper. Tailwind has what? Two turns left? I can hope he messes up. I'm gonna just freeze dry Pelipper. And then Gyarados will protect. I can only use Dragon It's Oh no. Oh no. Bring an Arcanine. Bring an Arcanine. Quick, 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 quick. Thank you. So that's how it works. Okay. We're gonna do this. Bring in the Arcanine. It's not gonna do much, but I can definitely live with electric. I can live with, live with an electric tech. From the Raichu. We're gonna hope, we're gonna hope Pelipper messes up and goes to like, I don't know what. T-Bolts. Gonna live it. Pretty damn well. There's a Scald. That will kill Ninetales, unfortunately. Crit! So even... Okay, thank... Okay, I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Uh... Now, I'm gonna bring in the Coco. 
So like here's your terrain. This is a tough matchup, guys. I'm I think I'm doing well in it right now because we're tied, but I'm not doing amazing because the talent is still up for this last turn right here. The good thing is that Sash is broken, so I can easily T bolt you to oblivion. But the terrain is still up for another two turns, which really sucks. Double protect, obviously get rid of Tailwind, so we can SP Pelipper. He might read that and switch out. It's a very obvious play I'm doing right now. But he might not. And if he doesn't, that's free T-Bolt fodder. Oh, damn, Pelipper. He did not switch out. Beautiful for us. Coco can't Oko. I mean, Coco can't, Coco can't be Oko by Raichu. Unless he has, like, Psyche MZ, which I don't think he does, so. He's going for Surge Surfer. He's going to paralyze my Arcanine here. It's going to trigger my berry, and I'm going to get paralyzed. That sucks, but I still have T-Bolt and Snarls to use. So it's all right. I'd rather Arcanine. If you go for my Coco, you're just, you're just flat out dumb. But Arcanine's going to get paralyzed here and live, live on uh, the berry. He went for Coco. What an idiot. What an absolute idiot. You can't even paralyze me. All right, that's fine, dude. That is fine by me. What, are you trying to bribe me or something? Skull is going to fail. Now we just go T-Bolt Snarl. Now in the back, do you have a chop, chop or anything? You either have a Lele, Coco, or Metagross. Either way, t with that slot every single day of the friggin' week. And then Snarl, can you switch anything out? Beautiful. Only thing bad is that one more, I'm gonna die to T-Bolt. That sucks, because I'm just below. It did, it did 96 plus 96 is 192, I'm 4 HP shy. That sucks. But, got a Snarl, man. In case Raichu goes to Coco again. T-Bolt, whatever Pelipper is doing. Because Raichu is still going first because of the terrain. T-Bolt goes off on, on Arcanine and he's dead. Why are you going Golduck? What are you, I mean, Coco, what are you doing? What are you doing? Sure, I'll gladly kill you, Pelipper. And I'll gladly snarl your Raichu so the Arcanine can now live. And yeah, plus you're weak to it. I don't know why he's not getting rid of the, the Arcanine here. That did a lot of damage too. That's beautiful. Terrain is now gone. You're going to bring in your Lele or your Metagross. And if it's Metagross, I just got to swap the rain and switch out. It's Lele. All right. Now, you Scarf Lele, what kind of friggin' Lele are you? This thing would be a pain in the ass. I have a Gyarados in the back. Uh, this is not the greatest situation to be in. I think I'm just going to Nature's Madness the Lele, do half to it. And you just snore with Arcanine. That's what I'm gonna do. So you're not scarfed. So we're gonna bring you that to half, which is amazing. She's probably bulky as hell. Beautiful. Coco goes down to his HP right there. Right, you go, Psychic on the. Coco is gone, and then Lele goes to Psychic and kills my Arcanine. So, like I said, we lose this game despite my opponent playing like a fool. Unfortunate, but what can you do? If that terrain wasn't up, though. If that terrain wasn't up, I might have lived that. That's all right. Life will ruin the league. I definitely would not have lived that. Gyarados comes in. Gyarados says, hey, man. Uh, can I play, too? But that's the game. Unfortunate loss, but... Like I said, that matchup is really tough for this team, and... I should have brought Sucker Punch. But if you have, if you have the Lele, I can't Sucker Punch, obviously. But maybe my opponent messes up, and I get a free... Uh, I'm just going to go Dragon Dance for the hell of it. I lose this game. We're going to go to game two, guys. It does suck that we uh, lose this game. But, like I said, the matchup is not there for us. I guess I should have brought Bulu because my opponent didn't bring the... Uh, my opponent didn't bring Metagross, which is very shocking to me because I have a lot of steel weaknesses. But, hey, he got it. Antonio got it despite his uh, odd plays. And we're going to move on to game number... Three and try to go 2-1 today's episode, my friends. So let's see what we got going on here. Ow, I'm stuck. My pants are stuck. There we go. Okay. Save the video? Nah, we're going to move on. Unfortunate loss, but hey, man, it's Pokemon. It was still an entertaining battle. I think overall the battle, it does suck to be lost, but that's a pretty entertaining battle. We made, we made a game of it. We didn't get completely destroyed. And, um... Honestly, I think I should have brought like a Rock, man. Would have been able to sucker punch the Raichu before the Lele came in. Saved Gyarados' life. Maybe take one Psychic, get a D-Dance off, and hit you with Waterfall in the rain. But you probably stole that out. I already used my Z-Move. But we did learn that Encore 
on a Z-move, I still get my Z-move off, and then I'm locked in. All right, my friends, here we go. I just didn't agree with my opponent's plays, by just going for the Coco. I guess you want to get him as low as possible, but you have a Lily with Life Orb in the back. You know you live in a T-Bolt. You know I'm not doing much damage to you. And you know that uh, you could easily outpace me with your Lily versus my Coco. So I think you should just gone for Arcanine. I think he definitely should have. But, eh. Who's mad? Not him, because he still won. So at the end of the day, we're going to game three. He goes with a W, and I don't. All right, let's see here. Game three. Once you find an opponent, that is. Hey! Mr. Hey, Jim! It's been a while, Jim. It's been a while since you took so long to find me an opponent. All right? Jim, I swear, dude. Little Sally has her summer festival tomorrow. And if you want to go to it, support Little Sally, you better get your ass finding me an opponent right now. All right? Don't give me sass, Jim. Don't give me, you are getting paid pennies already. Do you want less? Do you want hay pennies, Jim? Because I got them, and you'll get them. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, Jim, you son of a gun. Who do we got over here? Who do we got over here? Lele Arcanine, Finny, Chomp, Metagross, and the Mandibuzz. Mandibuzz, Finny, Mandibuzz, Lele. Ooh, this, has, this guy has options, dude. But I think I learned my lesson. I think I'm going to go Lycanroc Bulu. Oh, I'm going to go Lycanroc Bulu all day right now, my friends. Lycanroc Bulu. Or I could just go with Nine Tails. Nothing's actually really good right now. Alright, forget that. We're going to go with Nine Tails. We need Arcanine for the Metagross, no matter what. Or plus some Waterfalls would be pretty good against Metagross. We can also bring Garros. Garros is pretty good against Metagross, too. Uh, let's go with Nine Tails and... Hmm... Nine Tails Bulu sounds good. Yeah, Nine Tails Bulu sounds great. But if you go Arcanine, I'm definitely really screwed. So don't forget that. Nine Tails Gyarados sounds even better. Then we'll bring Bulu in the back, as well as the lovely Lycanroc. Or Cocaine to inject this matchup. Arcanine could intimidate Chomp and other Arcanine, but we're going to Gyarados to do that. Lycanroc could sucker punch things if the rain is not up. You know what? I want to bring Arcanine just for the Metagross. Yeah, let's be smart. Let's bring Arcanine for the Metagross. I know I... I like could have been great in this matchup, though. He could Stone Edge all the, the Manda Buzz and the freaking... He's up my po the Poison Arcanine stuff. Go with those scope lens crits. But regardless, I think we're okay here, my friends. Bounce Gyarados, Waterfall Gyarados. We're going to put in the work here, and hopefully we'll be fine. My opponent, what do you got, man? What is your squad? What is your squad? Metagross Mandibuzz. Interesting lead up right there. I go Nine Tails Gyarados. You got me good, honestly. However, I do get a free Dragon Dance because you can't do Jack to me, but you can foul play me. I don't like that one bit. Hmm. I think we're just going to go Waterfall Blizzard. I don't want to get foul played by Man the Buzz with Gyarados in right now. Or oh, just bring an Arcanine for the Gyarados. Better yet, save Nine Tails, bring in the Arcanine. And then Gyarados will indeed Waterfall Metagross. So I'm not going to, I don't feel like getting foul played right now. I, I want to try to flinch the Metagross. Let's do that. That's the play right there. Nine Tails, come on back, baby. Bring in the Arcanine. Throw in this Metagross next turn, and then avoid big foul play damage instead of regular foul play damage. Intimidate does not matter for foul plays at all. So, let's see what happens here. Waterfall goes on the Metagross. Boom! Let me see that flinch. Let me get that talented flinch. Brick break? And you would crit me. That's friggin' awesome, dude. I'm confused right now. I'm not gonna lie. I'm confused right now. Hell, it's everybody to demand the buzz because he is the, uh, the freaking thing. Interesting right now. Now we're going to flamethrower Metagross. And should I try Dragon Dancing? Because that's still with the Tailwinds, man. That's what I really got to do, but I don't want to. Maybe I'll just bounce with Gyarados. 
try to parallel something to stay in the air. Stole out a turn. So if I did this, I'm gonna take a huge foul play damage. Drainus is nothing. Drainus is absolutely nothing right now. Let's just ward off. Let's just double team Metagross. Get a thing out of here. Zen Headbutt gonna go off. Don't F word me. Barra's gonna go off here. Very nice. Alright, here comes a waterfall and a. I'll do dance next turn. Taunt. Ooh, you went for Arcade. Okay. Guess you uh, uh, to avoid the Will O Wisps. So I could have gone Dragon Dance, but it's alright. Like I said, it's useless right now, and this Metagross is gone. Just kidding. Just kidding! You get the flinch. You get the flinch. Arcanine can't protect now. I'm gonna get Zen headbutted. Uh, Flamethrower, Metagross, and Dragon Dance, Gyarados. Watch him taunt Mad Gyarados as well. Dodge it. Well, I'm nice and low. Foul playing Gyarados goes off. Oh, it's not Arcanine. Arcanine's out of here. Alright, D-Dance goes off for free, then I protect the next turn and dodge everything. Not too bad. Not too bad. We still have our Z-Move on tap. We lose Arcanine for no reason, but Metagross is nice and low. Alright. Do I bring in Bula? I'm not gonna bring in Bula. I'm gonna bring in Ninetales. I don't care about the hail. Oh, I do care about the hail. But I want to give HP back to Metagross, so we're gonna bring in Ninetales. Protect, protect, and then, because it's left turn tail, correct? Yes. Hail has one more turn, I believe. Protect on you, and then... You get one blizzard that's guaranteed to hit everybody. Alright, cool. So, man, the are still, like, not boosted by anybody, because there's no been, there's no been, there's been no terrains. So, Minigross might have Bullet Punch. Bring that to my Sash. Uh, you're gonna die to, you're gonna be at 1 HP from the hail, which sucks, which is a little bit lower. That damn flinch, dude. That damn flinch ruined everything. Absolutely everything. Double protect. And then we see what? Xenobot's gonna fail, obviously, and then so will Fire Play. Alright, we're gonna double team Mandibuzz next turn. Actually, we can't. Oh, we can't, because we could just Moonblast. I mean, we could just uh, Blizzard and Waterfall Mandibuzz. If I get a bullet punch, so be it. What other choice do I have? But you have Brick Break. You have Brick Break and Zen Headbutt. That's next to be uh, Medium Mash, and then you're going to have Protect, I believe. So let's go for Blizzard, and let's go for a plus one Waterfall on the Manda Buzz. That should kill it. Show me the bullet punch! Show it to me. Show it to me. Let's switch out. That'd be cool. We got one turn of hail left. You're not going to die to the hail. Metagross is gone. All right. Who's coming in? Top of Finny! Fine, buy me a freeze draw your ass, and I will uh, hopefully kill Mandibuzz right here. But you're gonna get your death boost here, so you're gonna live the blizzard. Hopefully, plus one waterfall is enough on this stupid Mandibuzz. Definitely not, never mind. Holy crap. No barrel off, never mind. This might. might kill ya? Eh. He has a big thick berry. Whoa. That's interesting. That's really interesting right there. Talon goes up. Not the end of the world, honestly. Because Flanium Z is going to kill that Finny, I believe. And we're just going to freeze-dry Mandibuzz. Let's go with Sky Strike on the Finny. But you might double-team Gyarados because you have Foul Play and then Muddy Water. That might slow me, which really sucks. So you know what? That's the way to turn us protect you with Gyarados. And freeze draw the man the buzz. I want to see if he goes foul play in uh, Moonblast or Muddy Water. I want to see right now. Muddy Water goes off, alright. I don't want to see if my Nintendo still has to speed the man the buzz. Probably not, it's doubled, but no, it definitely doesn't. It definitely doesn't. Alright, there goes the foul play on the Gyarados, like I said. And here comes a freeze dry. Freeze him? Freeze him? Ah. 
Even though Tyranitar is a flint, I can still possibly freeze him. Uh, freeze dry Mandibuzz. And Gyarados turns into Bulu. Gotta waste a plus one to my Z move. I gotta. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta. Alright, Terrain is in my favor now. Getting not to some HP back. Maybe get that Sash going again eventually. Let's see. We're going to see a Muddy Water and a Fat Play again, I believe. No dodges. Unfortunate, but let's see what happens here. Ouch. Oh, let's not play this game, Nine Tails. Oh, of course. Let's not play this game, Nine Tails. Let's not play this game. Thank you. Goodbye, Mandibuzz. Alright, Mandibuzz is out of here. Beautiful. Just enough right there. Now, Bulu. Negro actually is really unfortunate right now. Finny is exposed to Hornleech. We'll definitely die to a Hornleech. Tyrant should be going away at the end of this turn, correct? So I go protect here. So what do you bring in? We have Metagross at like 1 HP and an unknown. Alright, can we do this? Can we win this game? Come on. I mean, I'm not losing this game. There's no way I'm losing this game to that friggin' flinch and... Ah, I don't want to lose. It's Metagross indeed. Alright. I don't think he has Bullet Punch, guys. I really don't think he does. Talon is down to its last turn. So, Double Protect, obviously. I wonder if my blue is faster than the Finny. I doubt it, but... Actually, you know what? I can just bring in Gyarados here. And not protect. Yeah, let's bring in Gyarados here. Protect Ninetales, bring in the Gyarados. Get Blue's accuracy back up, and then hopefully Ninetales hits things. AKA that Metagross. So here comes Gyarados, eat up a Muddy Water, and then he Steel Tax Metagross goes for. And then we will, uh. Yeah, it's gonna be that. I don't wanna risk the Mist, man. I really don't wanna risk the Mist. That's why I switched into my Gyarados over the Bulu. Alright, Talon is now gone once again. Muddy Water goes off. Eat it up, Gyarados, will dodge it even better. Yes! Good job, Gyarados! Good job, everybody! I don't think this Mega Gross has, uh, has Bullet Punch. I really don't. Alright, Freeze Drive Finny and Waterfall Mega Gross. That's the play. Freeze Drive Finny and Waterfall the Mega Gross. No D Dance. Show me the Bullet Punch! I don't think he has it, guys. I don't think he has it. He does have it. Alright, but Megos is gonna die here. So he waited. He saved it. Not a bad idea at all. Crit did not matter. So good thing. Way she crits. Way she crits in there. Waste him. Goodbye, Metagross. That's gonna be a 2v2 now. But I have the Bulu uh, Finny matchup on lock right now. Z move. Oh no. My opponent might win now. Wait, is this Tapu and EMZ, or is this the, uh... What the hell is this? Alright, fine. I'll take Saber I said I was, uh, I'll gladly live. That's that's better than seeing for an EMZ. That's fine by me. We know you got Specs now. I will live, obviously, because it's new 70% of my current health. So I'm down to, like, 40, 34. Alright. I have the speed control on you. My Gatus is faster than the finish is huge. And we're going to see my Bulu come in here. As you bring in your what? Watch it be Chomp and just... That's really going to suck if that's the case. It's Lele. Ah! Oh! We lose this game. Can my terrain reset? Yes, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Good. That's actually huge. Uh, we're going to... Hornleech, Tapu Lele. And Gyarados is going to protect. I think this is how we come back in this game. I think this is how we do it. Because I think Lele's going to protect here. Yes. Got him. Friggin' got him. Let's see what Lele does. Dazzling Gleam? Alright, that's fine by me. Gladly horn leech you. Oh, you are specs up a friggin' wazoo, dude. Holy crap, Ola. 
You are specs like no one's business. Can this Hornage please kill you? Close, but no cigar. I'm back to full health. Uh... He's locked to the D-Gleam. So I'm just going to Horn Leech the Finny. And Garrus is going to go for a... Z-Move in case Lele... Uh, Lele in case, like, I don't know. Might as well go for the Z-Move on Lele, because... That's going to be that. D-Gleam goes off. Alright, there goes Gyarados. Blue is faster. No, he's not. Moonblast. Bulu, hang in there, buddy. Hang in there, Bulu! Uh, no! God damn it, dude. That sucks so bad that we lost that game. God damn it. We go 1-2 today, my friends. Not the end of the world. It does suck. Man, that last game pisses me off now. Specs Lele got it. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching, as always. I'm into Tal. You are the Glorious Talent Squad. Enjoy your day. I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed, show us a little like, to that like button down below. I'd appreciate that. And I'll see you guys next time.